Hello! I'm really struggling to get some videos. Why do I always do this? I always do this with my lips, you know, talk. Talk with the whole mouth. I've been so annoyed about that by my, my, my videos. But why do, you, why do you do it like this? Stop. But I'm surely going to do it some more. Uh, I have been filming. This is my third video I'm filming now. I don't know in which order. But you are probably going to recognize the look. Uh, and Gunval is really really annoyed by that I'm filming so I'm trying to do this a bit faster but every time I say that I kind, I kind of fail but I actually got tagged in a video <laughs> uh, my friend uh, Marlin like this Marlin Marlin <laughs> <laughs> on YouTube. I will link both her video and her channel down below. She tagged me in a, in a tag <laughs> and I'm so happy about that. It's so fun. So I thought I was going to do it right now. And the tag is called the makeup wishlist tag. I have seen other YouTubers do it. I think Angelica has done it and so on but I got tagged by Malin so that's why I really feel like I want to do it and I have read there are 12 questions and I will put the questions down below but some of the questions don't fit to how it is in Sweden so I will change, the, change them a bit and so did Malin and Angelica as well. But yeah, let's start with question number one. What is the very next makeup item you're planning on buying? I actually prepared some answers to this. Uh, and the next thing that I know for sure that I'm getting is uh, the new palette from Blush Tribe that they are doing with Paulina. Uh, I think it's just called Paulina, the palette. It's so, so beautiful. And just what I was expecting, but you know, better anyway. <laughs> I was expecting something amazing and it is amazing, but it's more than amazing. It's... I think they did a really good job and I'm so excited to buy that and I think it's going up for pre pre-order soon so that is what I know for sure that I'm going to buy and uh, question number two <laughs> if you I'm looking to into my iPad because I have a question there uh, if you could walk into Sephora today and buy any one item regardless of bodies what would it be well obviously it would be something expensive uh, I have just bought some things from Hourglass and Natasha Denona, but I guess I will buy something again from Natasha Denona, I think. Because I can't think of anything else that I really want. I'm trying not to buy as much as I um, used to do. <laughs> and I have bought a lot of things recently. Um, you know, when... Um, sorry. They have had discounts and so on, and maybe I will buy some things if there come up better deals for for Black Friday. <laughs> but I guess if I had the opportunity, I would buy Natasha Denona's Tropical Pal Tropical Palette and or the Sunset Palette. Oh my God! But I have locked the screen. Stupid phone. Sluta Gunvald. Can you hear me? Two, ten minutes, maybe. Please. He's just looking at me like what? Uh, but I think I would want to buy the sunset palette or the tropical palette because there's a colorful mattes and I really want to try the match. So that, I think, is what I would buy. Yeah, what I'm thinking about now. Uh, because I would, I don't think it's worth full price. So if I can get it, you know, I will take it. Uh, and question number three, what is the oldest item on your Sephora loves list? And that's where I'm going to change it because we don't have that. 
in Sweden. Um, so I'm thinking more like something that I have thought of buying for a really long time, but I just haven't done it. I put it in my cart so many times, but never bought it. And now it's out of stock at Beauty Bay and that is so annoying. But I think the brand is called OPV. Wait a minute, I have a palette for Yeah, OPV Beauty, that brand. Uh, I see if I can put it in a picture or something, but I want to buy the Yemoya palette, maybe it's called. It's the blue one. I would really love that one, and I have wanted to try it so many times. Shh! But you know, I always don't buy it. And I still want it. Uh, what is the newest item on your Sephora loves list? The newest thing I want, but I don't know if I'm going to buy, is I think the melt, the new melt palette. What is it called? Smoke. That I should have looked up. Smoke, nothing, 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 something. I think it's called, I'm on the fence because I don't like uh, when things are themed around weed, smoke, even cigarettes or alcohol or something like that. But I don't understand why you would do that. I don't like it at all. And uh, I think they're pretty colors, but I don't like that the pants have actual weed things printed on it. And... I don't want to buy it from their site. So if it comes to Beauty Bay, I will probably buy it. But I don't know. But I have my eyes on it. But I don't like the weed thing. Sorry. Not sorry. Um, what? Uh, number five. <laughs> what perfume is on the top of your wish, wish list? I have a perfume that I have wanted since I smelled it at uh, the airport when I was in London in, I think it was in 2011. And it's, why are they, what are they called? YSL, YSL, uh, the Black Opium one, the original, no, not the original, I will show you which one I mean, but that smells so good, but it's so expensive, and I have so many perfumes that it's ridiculous, so I, I can't just, no, I can't, can't make myself buy it, but I really, really want it, I really, really want it. Det är bara sju frågor kvar, gummal. Bara sju frågor kvar. I just told him how many questions there are left. Uh, number six. What is the new release you're looking most you're looking most forward to? Is that really a sentence? I don't know. Uh, new releases. I'm thinking more. Uh, I think that's a really hard question if I don't going to answer it the same way I answered question number one because of course I'm excited about Paulina's palette with blush try but otherwise I can say that everything that Jeffree Star puts out puts out I don't know and everything blush tribe <laughs> is announcing that gets me excited I think my mouth is crooked otherwise why do I do that do I always do that when I talk? When I talk Swedish as well? That's kind of a bummer to find out. Well, uh, so I know that Blush Tribe has announced, I think, at least two palettes. And those I'm very excited about. And I know that Jeffree Star will release some things in um, the next year. I'm not so... I, I get never get excited over foundations or concealers i get excited about highlighters and palettes that's what i'm getting excited about uh, and i know that he's going to release some and actually it's liquid lipsticks but otherwise i don't get excited about liquid lipsticks but yeah so everything that they do jeffree star or blush tribe and i probably have some other brands but you know these are the ones i get excited about oh god 
trying to scare me. Uh, seven. Are there any drugstore products you want but haven't yet pulled the trigger on? We don't have that many. You know, those brands that you call drugstore are actually not expensive, but they are not affordable in Sweden. So the only thing I can think of is uh, some mascaras. I know that there are a lot of mascaras that people talk about. There's one, there is one called Lash Paradise. Is that L'Oreal or who, are, who does have that? Well, that I want to try and some other mascaras. That's the only thing I can think of right now. Uh, before I bought... Um, what? Where did I put it? Before I bought uh, NYX Epic Ink Liner, that was one thing that I... I was eyeing for so long and didn't buy, but then I bought it and now I'm sad that I didn't buy it sooner because it's actually better than the Kat Von D Trooper liner because that one dries up soon. But yeah, otherwise it's just mascaras I think or no mascaras. Uh, eight. The eyeshadow palette you're lusting over the most. Well, I want my Jeffree Star Alien palette to get here now. Stupid beauty bay. <sighs> don't let. I don't want to get into it. But that one. But I have already bought it. But yeah, I want it to come to me. <laughs> and I think I have the feral palette in the post post office to go pick it up. So I'm going to do that tomorrow. Uh, that one. Uh, but if you're if the question is about things I haven't bought, then the Paulina palette. <laughs> It's the same thing, and oh my god! Shh! There are so many questions left, you are on question 8. No, 9. Product you're waiting for your next birthday or Christmas to ask for. I never ask for makeup, because my family don't know what I have. And I'm not trusting them to get it right <laughs> when it comes to makeup. And if I want it, I usually just buy it. And uh, I will get so annoyed if I see it on sale and I don't buy it. And then I don't get it in Christmas gifts or anything. <laughs> so no, I, I, I sometimes I, um, uh, I wish for... Gunvald. Um, I wish for a gift card so I can buy it myself, but yeah, so not nothing. Wait, you know what I'm just realizing? <laughs> I haven't put on my brows. <laughs> that means that in the other two videos I have recorded, I have no brows on. And that is the easy explanation is that I didn't used to do my brows because I don't think they are such an important feature on my face. Um, but yeah, I will now have three videos where I have no brows on. <laughs> okay. I just realized it because when I was looking down, <laughs> I saw my brow thing. Oh, okay. Never mind. Um, ten. What is the item that you're dying to have that is not available in your country? Well, all of the Too Faced things. I really, 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 really want the Tutti Frutti collection. I would buy it all. I want to give Too Faced my money, but they don't want it. Because I want the Tutti Frutti collection. I want the white damn chocolate palette that is not coming here. I want the Clover, 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 I don't know, the green pet palette. I want that. Ah, oh, they just annoy me so much. I'm so surprised that we got the gingerbread collection, but mm -mm. that is what I'm annoyed about. <sighs> 11. What is the thing that you really want but you never buy because it's too expensive? Well, I wouldn't say never buy, but I would really like to try some Pat McGrath things. Um, I don't think there are... They are not more expensive than the, than the Natasha Denona, but if I'm going to buy it... Wait... 
Uh, if I'm going to buy the Path McGrath, I'm going to have to pay shipping to Sweden. Expensive for an already expensive thing. And I have to pay customs. And I'm not really sure if it's going to uh, arrive, sorry, arrive <laughs> in one piece. And I'm just... Uh, I don't want to think about if I uh, get it and it's in a million pieces. But yeah, that would be so expensive. So... I'm th kind of waiting for it to arrive to some retailer that I can buy from. But I'm kind of intrigued by the brand. But also, there is not some things that I really, 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 really want. I'm more like I want to try it. And yeah. yeah now I'm just rambling. The last question. Uh, 12. If there was a beauty product... No? If there was a beauty product genie who could grant you one wish, what would you wish for? Well, I would wish for the same thing as Malin and Angelica wished for, and that is to make a brand to release everything at the same time in all damn countries, or at least that so I can get a hold of it, like Beauty Bay or Cult Beauty or something like that. But if we put that aside, because that's not going to happen, even though Fenty Beauty can do it, I really, really want a shimmery yellow I want a neon yellow that is shimmery that is not gold I'm trying to think of one and maybe I have one in my collection please tell me where you have found a shimmery neon yellow that is not a gold and I can't think of a palette at least but I'm obviously forgetting something but please tell me if you know one that is what I would wish for. Yes, that was the makeup wish list tag. <laughs> Thank you, Marlin, for tagging me. And uh, you should really go check her out. I have, as I said before, her video and channel down below. And she also speaks English, even though she's from Sweden. And she has a lot more subscribers than I have. Uh, go check her out and see what her answers were, because they were kind of different from mine and yeah me and my non-existing brows will now take Gunvald for a walk before he tears up the apartment so yeah uh, that was all from me and have a nice day bye